All Saints. All Saints, guys. And she is new with tags. <sighs> It's Alaska here with another video. <laughs> if you don't know me, my name is Alaska. I'm a reseller. I sell on sites like Poshmark and eBay. And I come here to do my thrift hauls and show everyone that they can do it too. So if you like this video, please subscribe down below. Leave me a comment. Let's get started. Okay, guys, I'm not going to hold her to the end. I want to go ahead and show everybody her now. Like, I'm going to go ahead and reveal her. She is All Saints. And if you've ever sold All Saints before, if you've ever, you know, come across this brand before, you know what I'm talking about. You know the type of profit margin you're going to get when you pick her up cheap with tags. Okay. So this, I don't know what she's called. I have to go look her up. Well, I'll look her up and I'll put her on the screen. But she is a gorgeous, like a zebra or a tiger print. It's some type of animal print. High neck. Oh, she's gorgeous. Look at that. Uh, she is gorgeous. She has like a like a slip underneath, if you can see it. It's like a slip underneath. And then it like has a drop back. The back drops or, or it opens. Should I say it's an open back and then a slip comes up a little bit. It's got like a rush sides or look, look at that with the ruffles. How cute is that? If this was my size, guys, if this was my size, like I will be rocking this dress. I'm not even playing. This is cute. This is gorgeous. Guys, I'm not even kidding. I'm like, I just want to tell somebody. I just hit the jackpot. Like, I just hit it. Here she is. Bam! She. Oh, I'm sorry. She's backwards. <laughs> She's backwards, but I got her now. <sighs> Look. Tadashi. And look how gorgeous she is. Look. <laughs> she is gorgeous. She is gorgeous. Look. Now, if you research this particular dress online right now, it's only one other person on eBay selling for her for over 200 bucks. Okay? But that's not her original price. Okay? She's probably four or five hundred bucks. If you look up these dresses, they are super duper expensive. Like I've sold this brand a couple of times before, and every time I do, not only do I get a good profit, I get it selling fast. Like it sells like this. I don't someone always got somewhere to go and they always gonna need a Tadashi dress. And I got one. I'm gonna find a forever home for her, and I'm very proud of myself. For finding her look the next item is these better brand these are cute i love the color on these i love the color and by the way these smell and they feel absolutely 100 brand new like no one's wore these you can see how tight they are like no one's touched these no one's put their body in them you can tell you can tell when you've been doing this for so long you can tell when you come up on something that no one's ever worn before. You can just feel it. You can tell. You can smell it. You can, you can, you just know. And these feel like they have never been worn a day in their life. And you can also tell by like, it's not rubbed off in anywhere. There's no cracks in the labeling. See? So that's how you know. These ones most likely are brand new. And these are cute. And like I said, this brand sells very well for me. Um, there's sometimes a hit and miss um, because some people online right now is trying to sell it for um, lower value and sell it for super cheap. But um, from what you know, I've learned very recently is just set your price, put it out there, and wait for the right buyer. Okay. This the next item is Athleta. Now 
She's cute. Is that my hair? Okay. She's cute. She's the velvet. She's cute. Now, the velvet tights are in. They really are. If you get uh, anything velvet like uh, Spanx, the Spanx velvet ones are going for 50, 80 sometimes, sometimes 100, 100 bucks, depending on the color. You know, it just depends. You have to really research your items before you pick it up or while you're in the store, research it. And if you also, if you, Lululemon now has um, their velvet um, leggings. So I, I can't wait to find those one day, but if you find them, they're in right now. They're selling for a good amount of money. So if you find them, these are at, are Athleta. I'm hoping to get at least, I don't know, 40 bucks, maybe 50. It just depends. I'm not really sure how far Athleta um, goes in the athletic world, athletic world, but we'll see. These are J. Crew. As you know, these are the 365. As you know, J. Crew absolutely 100% sells for me all the time. I pick it up everywhere. Um, I do pay attention to the tags, um, so I don't just pick up any J. Crew. Like I said, when I go out, I'm looking for a certain style. I'm looking for a current tag. Um, and I'm looking for, you know, my profit to be good. So these are wide leg. And as you know, wide leg is in. Got the large pockets. And these are the 365. 365 are the ones where they kind of have a suit that matches them. So these are good because a lot of times when you get the 365, someone has the blazer to it. And a lot of times they're looking for the pants. Or you ha they have the pants and they're looking for the blazer. So when you see a 365, make sure... Um, you look it up, get the right um, style number on it because someone might particularly be looking for it. This is Chico's. As I told you in my last videos, I sell Chico's all day long. Chico's and Talbot's, I sell all day long. A lot of people don't want to sell it, but I sell it. it. If it sells for me and it sells fast, I even sold Chico's this week. So listen, it's fine. Uh, these are new with tags. And this is like a, um, a button down top. It has like, I don't know if you can see it. It's like a glitter shimmer. You might not can see it in there. It's like a shimmer kind of effect to it, but it's really cute. These are, oh my God, guys. I totally forgot I got this. I don't know how I forgot. So here's the story. There are these pants in the medical field that apparently are selling very well. Um, $50 or more. Um... And I happen to find them. Like I didn't, I never ever pay attention. I don't go look for smocks. Like I don't go into the area where all the, you know, the nursing stuff and area. I don't, I don't go in there. These ones were sitting um, in the workout area, like where the workout clothing are. So that's why I was, when I found it, I was like, must be meant for me to find. This is called Figs. And like I said to you before, I usually, like, I don't, I don't look at, Medical, that's not my thing. I don't I I don't even go on that side. And so so when I found her, I knew immediately because I've seen other um videos where this particular brand they say sales and you know the medical people and the medical field people are literally looking for these smocks. So if you come up on these <laughs> fix, pick them up. This is overalls. Overalls are in, especially in the summer. This one happened to be like a dress. It's not shorts, it's like a little dress. Isn't it cute? It's like a cutoff dress. And it is your free people. And I pick up free people if it's the right price. Like I said, you gotta be careful with free people. There are two different types of free people. There's the free people that they sell at Marshalls and TJ Maxx. And there's the free people that they sell in the free people store. And you see the difference. And I'm not just talking about styles. I'm talking about tags. The tags are completely different. So you gotta pay attention to those tags because if you're selling... The ones that are coming from the free people store, the pe the people that shop at the free people store know the difference. And so <laughs> the people that are selling the, the tags are at Marshalls and all that and, and TJ Maxx, they they know those are not the ones, the, the styles that are sold in the actual free people store. They know that. And so you got to make sure you pay attention to the tags. This particular one has been sold in the free people store. Okay. And the ones that are like... I'll make another video on the difference between the free people, the ones that sold in the store and the ones that are sold, you know, at TJ Maxx and other stores. So 
I'll make a video on that just to give you, you know, some, some hints on what to pick up. The next one is Athleta. This one is like a zero. So these are super cute though. Like, let me tell you something. Athleta sells and it sells well for me. I don't have problems with Athleta. Every time I put Athleta in it, like it's kind of selling to be honest and you know, maybe down the line I'll probably change my mind in this video, but it's right now it's selling more than my Lululemon, honest to God. So <laughs> if you find some Athleta, pick it up because they seem to be, this brand seems to be doing well, doing well. You know, and make sure it's the right tag because like I said, people know when they're shopping, whether, you know, it's an old tag or a new tag, they know. Even people that don't, don't do reselling, they know when they go shopping, their favorite brands, they know what the current tags look like. So keep that in mind. Okay, this one is another Athleta. It is not by the same person because I thought when I was at the store, I said, man, someone just threw all their Athleta. No, no, no. It's not by the same person. This one is actually a 10. The other one was like a zero. So this is a totally different person that gave this one away. And so this one, this is a newer tag, has pockets. It's a like army green. It's super cute. I love Athleta. I have some leggings and pants in Athleta. And I mean, it just fits me well because, you know, with a reseller career, you know, I'm always in lounging gear. Like I'm always in leggings. I'm always in, in some type of sweatpants or, you know, joggers. And Athleta is where it's at. You know what I mean? If you don't want to pay the Lululemon, and for me, I can shop at Lululemon on some things, but not all things. And if you don't want to pay the price of Lululemon, Athleta is where it's at, okay? So, she is cute. And she will sell probably in the next couple of days. That's how Athleta has done for me um, in my store. I just can't keep it. So. Okay, the last item. Now, I have to do some explaining before I show you this. Because in my last video, I don't know, a few videos back, um, I had talked about what sold and this particular brand sold in my um, store it was like my eBay what sold video and it sold but it didn't sell for what I wanted it to sell for so um, I said that this brand you know lost its value and I was never going to pick it up again I really have to take it back and I'll tell you why because there is a reason to my madness okay now she is the one teaspoon. Now, the reason why I picked her up again, even though I said I wouldn't, it's because she was super cheap, number one, okay? And number two, when I looked her up in the store, I researched her in the store, guys, and she was, so, this particular one, recently, with the drawstring, sold for 50 bucks. And so I said to myself, Let's try her again. Let's try her again and see what she'll do. But these are cute. It's the drawstring. And I don't know if this is just a newer tag. I have no clue. I have no clue. I'm, you know, I'm still trying to um, make friends with her again. Like I, I, I totally X'd her out in the last video and said I would never pick her up again. And now I'm here holding her. So. I have to do a little bit more research to see what is the current tag for her because my last pants or the, the, the jeans that I had, they were brand new with tags. So I thought those were the newer tags, but I could have been wrong. So I literally looked her up and just like, she literally sold for 50 bucks. And there were some other ones um, kind of similar to her that were selling for more. So we'll, we'll learn together. And I'll let you know if she sells, if she sells fast, if she sells it's slow, even if she sells at all, like, and how much I'm hoping to at least get the $50 that last person got. So pray with me. That's my video. That's the end of my haul. Again, thank you. So, so, ugh. <laughs> Again, thank you for subscribing. Um, and if you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe below. L like send me your comments i love to hear from you i'll see you in the next video